Well, I'm gonna just do a brief video of what's gonna happen. Um, so, this will be, uh, say, a family room floor, and what's gonna happen is this kitchen's gonna be torn apart. Um, everything's coming out of here eventually, but right now, where these win two windows are, is I have to open up the wall and the ceiling because I have to uh, jack jack and king stud down on either side of this window opening because eventually this is going to be a sliding door to get access out onto this deck which is going to remain and, uh, and the reason for the jack and heading is because it's going to carry the load of the of the bridge above and also the the floor load of the um, my the floor above the third floor framing has to come and carry on down through this opening. This door comes out. This gets closed off, and then there's going to be a staircase that comes down from the from the basement level up here, and then from this foyer entrance area, another one above going going up. So all the stairwells follow each other. Oh, let me just get out here, and I'll show you. And then what's happening here is where this window opening is now becomes a sliding door similar to this, but over here. And then above this is the framing that I have to put in for a bridge that's going to bridge across and, and meet the new addition. So that's what I have to do, open this wall up and get the framing in there to accept the header to carry the floor. And then actually, um, we'll probably end up jacking up to carry the the roof on the um, the bridge. I call it a bridge. It's a bridge to get over into the new addition from the old house. So, anyways, that's what I'm gonna do. Tear it apart from the inside and leave the exterior so it's weather tight, and uh, get that bridge framing in because we need to frame that bridge in when we do the new addition because when it's all framed in and weather tight we need to get the utilities over there so your plumbing's got to go over there your heating has to go over there drainage electrical's got to go through this bridge so that's part of the reason why we're attaching the new bridge to the old house because it's in phases the new addition gets done first and then the stuff i have in the old house gets transported over to the new house and then when i the, the new addition's completed then we can do and come and remodel the old house so that's that's the idea anyways so anyways I'll do a video of the wall opened up and stuff so you can see the framing in there and the headers that are gonna go in up there okay